Morning guys. Hope you're all well. I'm not too bad. Well, up to now, it's not raining, but it has. It has been. It's quarter past eight. I'm just waiting on me, uh, Morrison's delivery. It's due between half eight and half nine. So I'm hoping to, it comes early and then I can get out. warm though. I'm hoping this rain stops. It did say it was going to be sunny today and light wind, no sign of rain and then it's light rain tomorrow. I'm all worried at the moment about my son. He's proper upset at the moment and I don't blame him. His car, it don't look good. He lives by close, not far, from the River Seven. I don't know if you've heard about it on the news. But yeah, that's, uh, and he went to the shop yesterday for a couple of things. And then uh, he said it wasn't too bad. And then uh, the River Seven burst its banks. And it's come over the road, on the path, and it, they've got um, a little garden bit outside, and that is uh, full of water, and heh, he's got an underground car park. The cellar, where he is, is about flooded, and it's up the first five steps that you walk up to come into the apartments and the water's about the fifth step up now the whole cell is flooded but of course the underground car park and the water is above his tyres he said I'm going to lose the car mum he said it was there was a lot of water Obviously, and it's not just this storm, what was it, Henk? Henk, they called it. We've had rain since October, so it's been building up like October, November, December. Then that storm Henk come. So he said the road was flooded. But... You could walk kind of along the path it didn't seem too bad and then uh, all of a sudden yeah there's no flood barriers they only put them in certain places their main focus is the town centre but he said, the thing is, I 
They haven't thought about flood barriers in the worst place it does happen is where that end of town where he is. So yeah, he was doing his uh, tea evening meal last night and one of his neighbours banged on his door and he said, uh, what's up? He said, have you seen outside? He said, no, I'm cooking. And he said, yeah. He said, you'll be in for a shock. And it was, it, it's flooded. He said, it's that bad. You can see all sorts floating past in the water. And it is disgusting. It smells, well you can imagine, there's been all sorts in that River Seven. So, they both went to have a look down in the cellar, because uh, he said, what's it gonna be like down there? And yes, it's flooded. There was only the one step where the water come over it. But as time got on last night, he said it's come up now another four stairs, another four steps. And the car park, it's just like the banks have just can't control. All it is is this thin metal fencing and then the water's come over and then it's just flooded everywhere. And he said, what well, I'm going to do about the car, BMW he's got. And his neighbour's got a Mercedes. He said, oh my God. So he says, what can you do, Mum? There's nowhere to park your car, you know, somewhere else. Because there isn't, because most of Shrewsbury's flooded. He said there's no way, you know, we could have put the cars. But it's never been, obviously, that bad as this. 2020 was the last time. It was bad, but there were uh... it's everything was weird because I went in the shop, yeah. There was all like water on the road and cars were driving slow through it. And then they put like these uh, barriers up to close each end of that road. And the barriers they put off have just gone down. They went floating down towards town somewhere. So. He said, I think I've lost the car, Mum. 
His neighbour said, we'll put it this way, how are we going to move it? The wheel bins have took off. He said, you can see them just floating away. You can't just do nothing. He said, I, I don't know how we're going to move the cars. Because they it's all over the tyres now. It just come in like a big tidal wave. Right guys, just been to Meat Man. The butchers are here, so I've got some sausage. I love the tomato sausage off him. And I got some bacon. Because I noticed I was low. And I think I bought some on my shopping haul. I can't video while I'm on this because I'll get in trouble. Right, I'm in a charity shop now. Tops £3, so I've just found myself two. No, I don't like that one. Let's go down here. Men's shirts, suits. Look at this. £12 for a, a suit jacket. That's not bad, is it? Oh, I'm on a pack, okay, uh, bump. Oh, I thought, why am I moving? Changing room. See, it's a big charity shop. It's huge. Blankets. Kids' clothes. Let's back up here a minute. Yeah, kids toys. Oh god. Oh god. Keep bibbing me horn. Pictures, aren't they pretty? Kids. I've got a key ring on me saying gonna keep jamming. Yeah, you've even got a changing room look. Yeah, I don't want to come on video. Oh, Frames. Three pound Wilco photo frame A4. Oh, I wonder if that's going to fit. A4. That looks a bit too big for my son's picture because I dropped and broke the frame. Another thing to do is buy a picture. And take the picture out and you've got your frame. No. Damn it. But that would... Right, I'm going to get that one. Right, I'm going to go because I don't want to put them on. Because there's... Um, the other side is a policewoman. She's <laughs> she's coming, she's talking to a lady in here. So I'll go. I don't know what's going on, guys. My phone keeps going off. Is there a spirit in here? That's not what bad. 150 for choco pop. 75p for Texan style beans burger. 150 for the pizza. Oh, soup. Pot noodles. 85p. I'll get one of them. The price of them. Shove it on top. Noodles, I don't need them. This phone's weird. See, you've got all your foods and that. Not that I want that. See, 125, come in here and get your love. I'm gonna have a whiz down the bottom because it is. It's crazy, look, the store is empty. But there's a lot of people here. Milkshake, 225. I don't know why I'm showing you all these. Not bad, 10 pound. Joggers for a man. 
no, there's not much of a sale. I'm not going there, staff. Two pounds for socks. I try and avoid people and staff. Oh, aren't they cute? Why haven't I noticed it before? Mind you, I know I haven't been out since before Christmas, but... Biscuits. Yeah, 100. Oh, 50p custard creams. I've got two of them because that's awesome. Oh, God. See? Ugh. That's our kebab house. There was another one. Oh, there, above the pub. You see them? Blue and yellow. It's amazing, isn't it? That's our butchers. And this is engraving for cups, trophies and key cutting. Half price sale. Oh, he's close. And this is pet calm drops. Ah, oh, that's handy. Right, I've got to watch coming down here now. But this is another part of town. I'm heading for the range. Right, finally in the range. And it's quiet. Look at that. Right, I bought them. Go for Christmas for my son. He loves his monkeys. Six pounds and they were... Hang on, let me back up again. There were 12. But he loves his monkeys. Oh, I know. I bought a Christmas present. Aren't they cute? Seven pounds. I want to But these are all too big. Church candle. <laughs> I think mine's bigger than that one. No. These are all too big, these vases. That's what I come really in for. But I thought, those monkeys, he can have... I want a tall, thin... Vase because what the heck is that? Oh, it's a weight, must be you put by your door. I can't see that well because my eyes are streaming after being all candles. Five pounds. I definitely don't need flipping candles after that big one my son got me. Bottoms. No, I can't find a vase. I want a tall, thin one. Flowers. Okay, thank you. Give me my glove. Glove back. No, I can't find any. There's something with this scooter. There's something not right. This, unless the floors are all bumpy. Cow, seven ninety nine. And what's it off ours? These aren't bad. Sorry, am I in your way? <laughs> Waffles, five pound. Not very polite, I must admit. The staff in here. Oh, cow! Oh, farm theme. Wow. Some really nice things. That's got a big dint in it. Right, I'm going to get out. It's not... It's all right, but... 
I don't think it's a place I would come in regular, you know, like I do with my other places. It is a bit dear, but it's not too bad. I've got some monkeys. See? Hear no evil, see no evil. No evil. Is it smell? And the brass, guys. £12 to six, right. This is the problem. Till areas. Right, I'm going. Right, back in my antique place. Can't smell bacon today. Got a size of that. I haven't bought much today, but I didn't want anything. I've only come to have a look for sales. I might get myself a fish. Oh my God, look at that, guys. Oh. Trouble is, when I come here, there's something new every time. Sale, £120. Early Chris and it's a Macless early Christmas present for someone. Because things come, things go. That's what I mean. Mark Towns have brought you in here. But there's something different every time. Postman Pat. See, there's always something different. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. Many, many years ago. No, mine was a plain brown one. I had one. That's 20 pound, that one. Don't need, I'm not buying for the sake of buying. We've got some nice things in here. Got some cutlery. Oh, she's pretty. No. See? There's a lot of different things in here now. I've got the church up, which is the other side of town. Oh, that's nice for the garden. I assume it is, isn't it? Oh my God, it's solid. Oh, I can't see. I'm right next door to my doctor's. 60 pounds, yeah, angel, it's for your garden. Oh, wow. And then you've got the pixie look on his uh, thing, whatever you call it. Snail, I'll say it in a minute. Oh, about the weather and people, homes have been ruined, flooded. And up by the hospital where I went for my x-ray, they are flooded. Oh, penguin. Nine pound he is. Oh, what I'm going to have to do is uh, put music over. Over it. Sometimes you can get away with something. See, last time I come here, the bed was here. If you remember, now it's all kitchen like furniture. But last time I was here, the bed was here. If you all remember that. I've got my brew. There's a place next door, I'll pop in there. A reduced rail. All like old clothes, I think. But saying that, you know, they're good for like, you know, probably theatre or something like that. Pantomime. Or whatever. But it is. You think I've been here a few times with you guys, and every time I come, there's something different. This is what he wants a longest war, but from IKEA. I can I try? Kel. in boots funny face monkey £15 
try me. No, I'm not. Henry Heath hat box, look guys. It says actually Henry Heath. Glasses. That's a big fish. Cars, motorbikes, more pictures. Oh my god, look at that. Let me zoom in. Where is it? Look, ready? It's one of them fox furs you put around it. Oh. The ladies. Certain, was it rich ladies used to wear? Or oh, years ago. Ten pound. That is so cute. Elves in snow. Elves. Gnomes. Seven dwarfs, I'll say it in a minute. No. Yeah. Up where my son is, someone just said now. It was on the news, the radio about Shrewsbury. She said, look at that, John Wayne. It's signed. Don't know if it's genuine or not. But yeah, it was on the news and TV that Shrewsbury's suffering bad with the water. I thought, yeah. Some lady was on the bar and said, yeah, it's took me cut the sun and his neighbour's car. Wow, look at them guys. Oh, can I reach one? Turn this bottle into a crusher milkshake. Wow. And look. Different ones. I don't know what he is. I don't know what he is, but he's uh, 40 quid. Oh, the boat's still here. No one's had the boat. Wow, helmets. You see them? That's not a genuine police helmet. That's what they used to wear years and years ago. <gasps> I spotted something. Oh, my God. Old English Bulldog coffee table in there. But they haven't put it out yet. But it's a tag. Oh, my. I know you'd love that. Can you see it? Oh, I know who'd like that. So, yeah, Shrewsbury is the worst hit. We're not too bad here. We're lucky here. We're not too bad at all, but where my son is, they're all saying it's on the news or radio about it. That's what I've just bought. In the range, the three little monkeys, it was six pounds. I thought, no, it'll go up for Christmas next year. I know I've just had Christmas, but bar you <laughs> guys laughing at me, you must have she's gone crazy. Oh, look, a duck. Christmas things. They've got some Christmas things. I shouldn't look at this lot. I come for sales and 20% off. Oh, little. Oh, a gonk. No, I've got to behave myself. I've got to behave myself. I've 
definitely got to behave myself. Let's have a look down here. Pillows. Oh, yeah, pillow, pillows. This is freezing, guys. Fresh coffee, almond cakes, vintage teas, sandwiches, panini, bacon bats, sausage bats. Only thing is, you've got stairs. And a lot of people can't get up them because they're very narrow. Oh, Bublet. Bublet. Oh, the LPs are here. So they've had to move around because I'm sure these were somewhere else. Yeah, I'm sure these were somewhere else. Yeah, nothing today, guys. I don't think it's a scooter. Maybe I'm not just... Just seemed odd. Right, I'm coming out now. I'm coming out now. I haven't got anything today. Like I say, it's only having a look. I sell stuff. Wow, look at the old toys. They've even had to put them in a glass cabinet. Wow. Yeah, I'm going to go now. I've got gotcha. to... Right, I'll go... I'll go and have a coffee. Cup of coffee. This is a restaurant. Look at that for a bike. It's lovely, isn't it? Really nice. Right, I'm home. Thankfully, I can't believe it's caught to one. I wanted fresh air and go out, but three hours. Mind you, I've been this end of town, the far end of town. Mind you, I, was, I had a cup of coffee in that restaurant. So I was in there, what? And talking to the, the lady in there, she's really nice. I, it's uh, pretty quiet. There was only a couple in there. I know I've got my bag and everything in the way. It's just so cold. Town is dead. I thought, well, they'll give rain tomorrow. Light rain. We don't need it. Everyone's going on about Shrewsbury and how flooded it is. I thought, yeah, I know. My son's car is blooming in it. Oh, damn it. Good start to the new year for him. I'll keep my gloves on till the heating comes on. Good start to the new year. They're getting rid of the water in the town, but they need to go back the other way where he is. I'm not sure what they can do. I don't. Oh my God. Yeah, I'm glad to be home, put it that way. I'm certainly glad to be home. But I thought, well, you don't know what the weather's going to be like tomorrow, do you? You just don't know with the weather. I hope that water drops where he is. But even so, the damage has been done. It's not just him, there's homes flooded. Oh God, what a start to a new year for them all. So I'll show you what I got. Yeah, I was in the cafe half an hour. And I thought, that's it. I know when enough is enough. And I've got, I thought I've got to get home. I just wanted to get home today. I'd had enough. I thought that's it. I quit. <laughs> it's done me good. I think I'm some fresh air. I know my limit. But yeah, I had a coffee in that restaurant place. And then I had, uh, you know, 
I'd stop and chat to someone and I see my neighbour, I'd chat with her and I thought, no, I've had enough. So these I brought her away. So I'll show you what I got. I just want to look at the sails. I've just put the heating on now. That's what I went for. Right. So as it gets warm and take my coat off. <sighs> but yeah, I'm glad to be home, to be honest. It's just, it's cold. But I'd had enough. I just thought all I want to do is get home. I want to get home. I didn't hang about. I come up the road, all the way along the road. It's I can uh, come up the road on a different speed. I've got four miles. Is it four miles an hour? Eight and eight. I think it is. So I I put it on the highest speed, and it because that is allowed on the road. So I come all the way back on the road. I'd pull in between cars if a car wanted to pass me and I thought, I just want to get home. I've got to get home. I want to get home. <laughs> That's all I kept thinking in my head. I, I do. I know my limit. And I, that's it. But I've been out. I've done it. And I've got fresh air. And yes, I know you're going to say, you've just done a Morrison. You've just done an Iceland. But I grabbed some pasta. No, I never. Did I get, no. I'm showing you things that I just dumped here when I went out. Oh, God, I tell you I'm not with it. That's me done. I'm not going out now till next week. So, right, let's start again. I got from Meat Man a pack of bacon. I thought I might as well. It was on offer today. It's normally, what's this one? It was £2. I think it's three ninety nine normally. Unsmoked Ryanless back bacon. 18th of January though. But that was £2 today. So I thought, well, I'll be... I might as well grab it, not bad, £2 for bacon. And then I got me tomato sausage, pork and tomato sausage, I like this. And this is 3 99 And this was 2 two eighty, I think, today. And the date on them is all right. Ah, 9th of January. But I, I suppose you freeze them, they'll be all right. I don't know, there's a fair few in there, look. I think there's more in there than uh, normal. Two, four, six, eight. There's about 12 in there. So I thought, right. I'm glad I popped it. What was that? Let's see. Hang on a minute, guys. Uh, my meat man don't sell chickens. So I have had to go to the other butcher. He's all right. He's not bad. He's a bit dear. Honest God, no words of a lie, I was shocked. I haven't had a, an actual chicken, see, in a long time. I've had chicken fillets, chicken legs and that sort of thing, but I haven't had an actual chicken. So I went to the other butcher.
and I've got a chicken. That's the size of it. It's only a medium. Nine pounds. I said, flipping heck, it'd be cheaper to buy a chicken for that. So imagine a large one. All right, it is fresh. But that is it. A medium size, nine pound. Well, my butcher doesn't sell chicken, so I'm going to cook it. It'll do me for a couple of days. And sandwiches and that. Kitchen roll, because I was out. And I didn't have any on my shop. Or did I? Do you know, I don't know what the heck I'm doing. No, I never. No, I didn't think of this. Good job I got one. Let me open this. I had a cup of coffee in that restaurant and I've got a queasy stomach since I've drank it. Mind you, all the rolls and packs are bumpy here. So you, you like this on the bloody scooter, you're bouncing up and down. It is terrible. Potholes, and the, all the potholes are flooded. There's a big hole in one of the roads, and uh, there's something like round, they've put around it because it needs repairing. Yes. I went in, where did I go? Oh, I went into the Morrisons. I went into Morrisons. I wanted to grab something from there on the way home. And these were reduced to 63p from 175 fresh mince pies. I don't know if they're any good. I know I've got a load, but these are fresh ones. So I said, come on, I'll have one. Uh, got me told in the old because I forgot that. I got me apple crumble, forgot that. I mean, oh, I can't say these. I'm not allowed to say this word. The two pork with sauce, meat balls. <laughs> I'll put it, you know what I mean? Look. But it's, I'm not allowed to say the word. I might get told off for showing this. So I've got them. I haven't had them for ages. Then I got these for my son to put up for next year, uh, this year for Christmas. From £12 to 6 Brass monkey ornament set of three. I think it's... Is it see no evil, hear no evil? I don't know. I don't say on it. Hear no evil. I don't know, but yeah, there you go. Proper brass monkeys. They were in the range, I thought. I know, I've just got over Christmas and I thought, well, I could put it up. Pot noodle. These, 50 pence each, so I grabbed them. I've got this in the range, 4 99 One metre. I 
I needed a cable, mine's broke. So I finally got one. At least the range sell these. There's no one else in town I could find one. I've been looking for ages. It's to connect my phone to my laptop. But mine's broke. It, it keeps uh, cutting out, if you see what I mean. Looks a good one as well. I should have gone... But I could go back now and get another one as a spare. So I finally got one. I bought this. It's from like a charity shop. And it's unusual. 50 pence. But look, it's a dish. It doesn't come off. Or is the dish like on a little saucer thing? I thought it's someone do that. I thought it's handy. It'll... I've never seen one like that before. Or it's got a dish underneath. That was 50 pence. Then in this charity shop again I went to, I got this, 50 pence. It's not a good one, but it'll do for now because, oh, definitely not. It's only 50 pence, but I'm going to have to get a better one than this. Looks like it's old. Well, it'll do for now for a photo because I dropped it and cracked the glass. So I'll have to get one online. This isn't going to last. I don't think it's even. Good job it was 50 pence. I didn't look properly when I got it. No, it's not going to last long. What can you expect for 50 pence? Then I got. This in the antique shop. She had a thing with um, birds perched on tree bench ornament. It was £8, pound, £6, pound, a pound, and then I got it for 50p. So originally it was £8. Pound. Yeah. It was eight pound originally, down to six. What did I say? Oh, God, I know, dropped it. Yeah, eight pound, down to six, down to a pound, and it was 50p in the end. I couldn't resist him. A little ornament. And then, lastly, I bought these two. They're all right when they've been washed. Two tops and this is by... Papier Essentials. It's a size 12, but it's stretchy look. So it'll fit me, even though it's a 12. See? I just hope... I like them, you know, a good length, but... It, right, put that in the wash. It should be fine. It'll be fine. And this is Primark. Medium. 12 to 14 but I don't see but it does go I think past me bum on I 
but it should fit me. So I've got them two, and they were six pounds for the two. And that's it. Right guys, I'm going to end the video. It's getting on now, but it's about all three, four o'clock. I don't know. It's something like that. I put these in boiling water so they soak while I was out. I just gotta go and wash now. I was gonna do them this morning and I thought no, I'll do them when I get home. So I just put them in boiling soapy water and left them. Right, so they can soak. So what I'm going to do while they're soaking, I've got my chicken in, I'm going to have some for tea. I own my new potatoes, I think, and some veg. And then I'm going to get your video up for you now. I've probably got to edit a lot out. Or it'd be part one, part two. It might be part one, part two yet. Which is fine. So, anyway guys, I'm going to go. Oh, God. Oh. So, I hope you're all well. So, take care. I hope you enjoyed the video. I did my best what I could when I was out. So, take care. Stay safe. Have a nice evening. Bye, guys.